Vietnamese, and Jimmy the assault in Saigon, and are taking control of part of the U.S. Embassy. Details are... Republican Richard M. Nixon enters the New Hampshire primary. Former President Dwight D. Eisenhower scores a dramatic hole-in-one while playing in a foursome at... Death Hole last week in Vietnam, 543. If your lawyer's sleeping, better give him a nudge. Everybody look alive, cause here comes the judge. Here comes the judge. Here comes the judge. Ebenezer Baptist Church in Atlanta. I'd like somebody to mention that day that Martin Luther King Jr. tried to live his life serving others. Segregation today, segregation tomorrow, segregation forever. And George Wallace of Alabama announced today his run for the presidency. I'm a doctor, not a brick. Scotty, get us out of here. February 27th, the CBS Evening News with Walter Cronkite. It seems more certain than ever that the bloody experience of Vietnam is to end in a stalemate. And it is increasingly clear to this reporter that the only way out will be to negotiate, not as victors, but as an honorable people who did the best they could. March, New Hampshire. <laughs> Senator Eugene McCarthy comes within a hair of upsetting LBJ. Get a haircut! We're, We're clean for Gene! Lieutenant William Calley and Charlie Company rampage through the village of Mila. I seek the presidency to end the bloodshed in Vietnam and in our cities, to close the gaps that now exist between black and white, between rich and poor, between young and old. American Peggy Fleming wins the Ladies' Speaker Skating Championship in Geneva. Oh, Master, Dr. Bellows will not be happy that we have sent him to the moon. Jeannie! I know nothing, nothing. In Memphis, strike and sanitation work at the March today. The National Guard is performing the store. March 31st. Death Hole last week in Vietnam, 677. The President of the United States. According, I shall not seek, and I will not accept, the nomination of my party for another term as your president. April 4th. In this difficult day, it is perhaps well to ask what kind of a nation we are. For those of you who are black, considering the evidence Evidently, is that there were white people who were responsible. You can be filled with bitterness and with hatred and a desire for revenge. We can move in that direction as a country in greater polarization. Black people amongst blacks and white amongst whites, filled with hatred toward one another. Or we can make an effort as Martin Luther King did, to understand and to comprehend and replace that violence, that stain of bloodshed that has spread across our land, with an effort to understand, compassion, 